Hi everyone, today I'm going to talk about the book A House for Hermit Crab by Eric Carle. The main character's name is Hermit the Crab. Hermit the Crab had to leave his shell because he grew too big for it. So he went out to the big sea by himself searching for another shell. He found the perfect shell and it fit him just right, but he said to himself, it's too plain. He went along to the sea and he found a beautiful sea anemone. He then found a starfish. He then found a coral. He then came across a snail. He then saw sea urchins. He then traveled across the deep, dark ocean and found a lantern fish. The last one was Pebbles that he asked to join him with all his sea creature friend to protect them. At the end, Hermit the Crab was too big for his shell, so he had to leave all his little friends and search for a new one. So the recent Hermit the Crab had to find another show at the beginning of the story and at the end of the story stories because he grows as how you grow. Everyone grows and we need new shoes, new clothes, and it's sometimes scary but we have to go out like Hermit the Crab went in the big ocean and found his friends. Okay, now we are going to do our art activity. We are going to make Kermit the Crab with his shell and you're going to choose one character from the story. So the reason why we're doing Hermit the Crab is because he is the main character. We are going to use our hands and our fingers to create a beautiful art and we're going to use it with paint. We're first going to put paint all over our hand. It's going to be red like Hermit the Crab. Then we're going to place our handprint in the middle of the paper. Place down your hand and it's going to look like this. Then you're going to wipe your hand so you can create the other beautiful colors. Okay, so now this is our handprint and it's going to be downwards like this. Our fingers represent his Hermit the Crab's legs. So then we can use our finger to make his little eyes. We can make his eyes with the color black. going to make his shell. You can make his shell whatever color you like. I'm going to use green and we are going to make a, a circle
and make more circles inside the big circle. You could also choose another color if you like. But remember to wipe your fingers just in case you don't want to mix the colors. I'm going to choose purple. Okay, we are done with his shell. Now we're going to paint one of the characters, another character from the story that was in his shell. So you could choose from a snail, from a sea urchin, from a sea anemone, a coral, a lanternfish, pebbles, starfish. I'm going to choose the starfish. So I'm going to color the starfish. Use yellow for the starfish and just place it above his shell. Remember to always write your name when you create art. So I'm going to write my name with purple paint. Okay, and I'm done with my beautiful art. Again, this is, we created Hermit the Crab, the main character from the story, and I chose another character that was in his shell, which was the starfish. I hope you all like this art, and I hope you like the book, A House for Hermit Crab, and thank you very much. Thank you.